Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is me Ubuntu Hokai and I've seen a lot of people uh, ask me about this problem right here on the screen right now. Uh, so they've asked me what to do when they get this message uh, when they boot their computer with Ubuntu. So uh, this uh, text right here means that, uh, for example, that you lost your power and uh, your computer shut down uh, unexpectedly or something like that. What you're going to do is you're going to find your live CD, your Ubuntu live CD. Okay, and then you're going to boot into the live CD and select try Ubuntu. Alright, so when try Ubuntu loads up uh, and you're at the desktop you see right now, well, not exactly the desktop you see right now, but a similar, you know, Ubuntu desktop. Uh, what you'll have to do is you will have to open up your terminal or open up a terminal and then type in sudo fsck-y and then uh, dev and sda1. Now, yeah, the partition that uh, Ubuntu is normally installed on is, is uh, called sda1. But if you uh, don't have uh, installed Ubuntu on SDA1 or if you're not sure you're going to type sudo fdisk l all right and I'll type in my password so right here you see it says uh, dev SDA1 and it has this uh, star symbol I don't know what it's called I can't remember but as you see this star symbol right here and that means that Ubuntu is installed on uh, the SDA1 partition so like I said before, if your Ubuntu installation is on SDA1, if it's on SDA2, for example, I doubt that, but um, you'll have to type in, in the Ubuntu live environment, uh, you'll have to type sudo fsck-y and then dev and SDA1, and then press enter and type in your password, and then you have to reboot and um, of course remove your live uh, Ubuntu CD, and then the problem should be fixed. So if you get this problem, then try this uh, and it should uh, work. So uh, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Remember to like the video if this helped you. Alright, peace out. Girl Scout.